big daddies. Mediterranean grill and hookah cafe, not just big daddies. At the door! Pondering what to order. This is a big decision in the life of Adam, Shay, and Julie. And here are the choices. Lots. Other choices, and up on the top of the choices, is the hookah. Orange Hookah flavors, bubblegum, well, cappuccino, and pomegranate. That does not sound very good. I know we were born here, raised here, we moved to Chicago. My dad had a business up in Chicago for a little while. We moved to Tennessee. And my dad and my mom missed their, our family back here in uh, Alabama, in Tuscaloosa. Mm -hmm. So they decided to uh, come back in town and open up a restaurant. And like I said, we've been here since August. The hookah idea was my idea. Okay. And mainly some of my dad's ideas. Here, so. Okay, cool. But uh, What's your most popular? thing you sell? The most Gears. popular thing is the gear on the Philly cheese steak. Okay. And those are actually the best in town. And what kind of meat is this? This is lamb and beef mix. It's like 70, 40. 70% beef? Yeah. 70% yeah. yeah. beef, 30% 30 30 lamb. lamb. yeah. Cool. Because if it was straight up lamb, it would just fall apart because lamb is so tender. My falafel being made. <laughs> being cut. Chickpeas. Here is my falafel, about to be eaten, and my cheesy fries, just blurched on. Adam, tell us about what you ordered today. I ordered a gyro combo with mint sweet tea and onion rings. That's the gyro, those are the onion rings, that's the tea. <laughs> All right, Shaylin, what did you order today? I ordered hummus, and it came with, what is this, what is this called? Non Flat bread. How many? Flat bread. Flatbread, not pita. One, two, that looks three, really good. four, five, it looks six, thicker seven, than pita. eight. You got eight little little slices. And Julie has already worked, started working on hers. It's delicious. All right, big bite, Adam. <laughs> All right, so what are you gonna rate your? Eight and a half. Eight and a half. Why? I don't know because I've been to Hooligans a lot and gotten the same thing, and it's better here. Okay. Shay, how do you write your hummus? Because you make hummus all the time. Um, so. I would give it a six. A six? And what it would you like write yours? Mine? I don't think mine's that good. I just... <laughs> I a wish seven. it had like olives or more flavor in it. Alright, Julie, what would you rate your hummus? I would rate it a nine because Ooh. this bread is really, really good. And I like the hummus a little bit bland, not too tangy. Hmm. Okay. Wait. Okay, Shay, tell us your overall rating of Big Daddy's. Um, well, I really, really like the onion rings, and I think they're like an 11 because they're awesome, and they're really crunchy. And then the euros are very good, but that's the only other thing I've had. So overall, because I don't completely like the hummus, I would say like an 8.5. So you're Almost a, a 9. Yes, I'm you're a Big Daddy fan. Man.